Where the thermocouple is connected, we will first check the temperature by installing a temperature gauge. After this, again insert the thermocouple and millivolts are checked. Thermocouples due to their simplicity, durability and low cost are commonly used in the field of temperature measurement. Today we will learn how to check thermocouple in field. Let us understand the steps to check thermocouples in the field. The first step is, disconnect the thermocouple. First the thermocouple is disconnected from whatever equipment or wiring it is connected to. The second step is use a multimeter. Now use the multimeter to check the continuity of the thermocouple. Set the multimeter to ohm setting or continuity. And touch both the thermocouple's connections with the probes of the multimeter. Here one point is important to note here that if the thermocouple is simplex, it will have two wires and its connection is taken at one location. If the thermocouple is duplex, it will have four wires and its connection is taken at two different locations. Like one connection is connected at any controller and other one is connected at temperature indicator the continuity should be shown in multimeter or resistance reading should be close to zero continuity is checked because thermocouple wires are short circuits at one end and if the reading is high or infinite the thermocouple is broken and needs to be replaced the third step is measure the open circuit voltage. If the thermocouple is connected in the field, and you suspect that it is not measuring the correct temperature, then to check that it is working correctly, you can check the open circuit voltage. For this, you will disconnect the thermocouple where the thermocouple is connected. We will first check the temperature by installing a temperature gauge. After this, again insert the thermocouple and millivolts are checked. To check millivolts, multimeter is set at millivolts. And, both knobs of multimeter are connected at thermocouple connections. Thermocouple millivolts should be according to the temperature. Voltage readings must be according to the thermocouple temperature voltage chart. If the readings are not correct, then replace the thermocouple. To check thermocouple temperature, look at temperature voltage chart only. This is a standard way to check thermocouple temperature. And, if someone asked you in interviews, you should answer that. According to thermocouple voltage chart, voltage is calculated. But, if you are using K-type thermocouple, I have a short trick for you. Sometimes chart is not available, then you can use this trick. The millivolts shown in the multimeter are multiplied by 25. And, add approx 30 degrees Celsius to it. Here we are taking, 30 degrees Celsius as environment temperature. Next check is check for damage. Finally, we'll check the physical damage of the thermocouple. For this, take out the thermocouple from the thermoval and check whether there is physical damage to the thermocouple. If thermocouple is found damaged, we will replace it. Its summary is, for checking the thermocouple in the field, its continuity is checked, open circuit voltage is checked, and physical damage is checked, and if any issue occurs, then the thermocouple is replaced.